Okay. I think I'm live. Um, what is up? What up, everybody? This is the ghost of Ernie Stockner. Coming back at y'all with the... What up? Okay, am I left now? Okay. What up? This is the ghost of Ernie Stotner coming back at y'all with the live stream here. This is going to be a short one. Um, Raider Ben's going live with his Black Friday hangout tonight since he's not doing it tomorrow. And that will be in about 40 minutes he starts it. So this is going to be a short one. As soon as the clock hits 11 o'clock, I will end this. So it's going to be a short stream, really short. Because Raider Ben's going live. So as soon, soon as the clock hits 11 p.m., then this stream is going to end. So um, anyways, um, Jersey unboxing, um, as you can see by the title, NFL Vintage Jersey Unboxing. However, there's a catch, though. There's a catch. It's in here, right? But there's a catch to it, though. Um, it is not a Pittsburgh Steelers jersey. In fact, well, it's not a Pittsburgh Steelers jersey, but it's not, it's not a jersey of any other existing NFL franchise. So... It's an NFL jersey, but it is not a jersey of any of the existing NFL franchises, if that makes sense. It's not. It's it's vintage, but it is not of any existing NFL team, which I of course I wouldn't rep I wouldn't rep another team or anything, but it's Okay, it's a vintage jersey, but it's not a Pittsburgh Steelers jersey, though. If that makes any sense, but I think every, I think every football fan, if they know their, if they know a little bit about the history, at least, if they know their history, I think any football fan is gonna like what I have in here. But again, it's vintage, and it, and you really gotta know your history. To know exactly where 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 the jersey that's in here comes from, but basically it's a it's not a Steelers jersey, but it's not a jersey of any other existing team either. So it is not a jersey of any of the thirty two NFL franchises. Okay, damn. I know that I I was just coming from a stream. I was just coming from a. From a live stream that I was in earlier, um, that TTC Live twenty four TTC Live twenty four seven, I think it's called. Now I was over there for a little bit, chopping it up. Um, there was a clown in there. There were some people in there, and then there was a clown that came in, and and then they started saying some weird shit. Somebody, well, no, I was only one person saying weird shit, and I was like, yeah, I'm out. I don't want to hear it. So. But this came in the mail when I came up from work, and I'm here, and I'm ready to unbox it. Um, damn, I want to see if maybe I could get a few more, because like I said, this is not going to be a long stream, because I am ending it. As soon as Raider Ben starts up his Black Friday hangout, I am ending this. Well, I'm kind of excited to, to reveal what's in this motherfucker, man. I'm excited to reveal what's in this, what's in this box, what's in this bad boy. So, um, yeah, man. And yes, I did. I did get it from the same. I did get it from the same place where, where I got that beautiful number 70 jersey up there. Got it from the same, from the same site where I got. Where I got that beautiful Ernie Stotner jersey. So, um, but it was a little pricey, not gonna lie, it was it was a little pricey, but can't wait to reveal what's in here, man. 
And all I got to say, man, I hope they don't fuck up on this. If if I get a jersey and it's and it's of some other NFL franchise, I'm going to be pissed. Unless if it's a Pittsburgh Steelers jersey. Now, if they mistakenly put a Pittsburgh Steelers jersey in here, then I'll be then I'll be like, okay, cool, you know, because I'm a Steeler fan, of course. I collect anything that's Steelers, but um, definitely something vintage in here, though. I cannot wait to um, unveil it, man. Got three people in the house, man. Damn, where's everybody at, man? Shit, man. Scottzilla, are you typing from my main channel or my backup? Because I'm live on both channels right now. I'm live on both channels right now, Scottzilla. I don't know if you're typing from my main channel or my backup. Which, the name down here goes as the name of my backup, of course. So, um, damn, where y'all at, man? I want to at least get a few folks in here so they can, so I can unveil this, man. Because I'm actually excited to unveil this. I'm actually excited to open this up and see what's in here. But um, like I said, it's not a Steelers jersey. And it's not a jersey of any of the 32 NFL franchises either. But it's an NFL jersey. Just not a jersey of any of the NFL franchises that are exist today. If that makes sense. Um, and y'all got to dig deep in the history to know where this comes from. Okay, now I see you, Scottzilla. Yeah, because the live chat here on my iPad, I have it on my backup. But don't worry. Um, I do have a special live stream tomorrow night. Tomorrow night, I do have a special live stream. Um, maybe a few of you could figure out why it's going to be a special live stream that I cannot wait to do, but, but that's tomorrow. It's a special live stream, and yes, it will be a hangout. I will drop the link and allow people in here tomorrow, but that's tomorrow night, though. Tonight, you know, this is obviously going to be a short one. I Let's see, I only got 35 minutes left of this live stream, so. Damn, where's everybody? Y'all motherfuckers are lurking in here, but I ain't typing anything, man. I want to know who's in here so I can unveil this bad boy. So I can unveil this bad boy right here. Because, I, like I said, man, I'm excited to reveal what's in here. I'm excited to reveal what's... What's in this bad boy, man? I am. Now, I was hoping I'd get a few more people in here before I open this bad boy up. Before I open this bad boy up. Because like I said, man, I'm excited to open this. I'm excited to open this. It, like I said, it's not, it's not an NFL team's jersey. It's an NFL jersey, but it's not a jersey of any of the 32 teams. I mean, shit, man. I wouldn't collect the jersey of any other team except for the Steelers. So, yeah. It's not a Steelers jersey, and it sure as hell ain't a jersey of any of the 32 NFL franchises. I mean, if it's about... If it's about 40-something minutes long, then I don't think people would waste their time watching 40 minutes of it, Scottzilla. I mean, come on now. Unless if it's a fucking... Unless it's a... Unless somebody's battling one-on-one -on -one with somebody. Unless, unless it's a... Unless you got two people battling and shit. It's not a soccer jersey. The title says it. It's an NFL jersey... But it's not a jersey of any of the 32 NFL teams. It sounds catchy. It's an NFL jersey, but it's not a jersey of the of any of the 32 NFL franchises. Okay? 
I mean, y'all, y'all gotta dig deep in history when y'all see what's in here, man. Y'all gotta dig deep in the history to know where it's, where exactly it comes from and the history behind it and all that shit. Yeah, it's not a it's not a Steelers jersey, although there is there is one Steelers jersey I'm waiting on though, but. I don't know how long that'll take to get here because it'll be a while, I think, because it does come from it does come from the same spot that I ordered this and that beautiful Ernie Stotner jersey up back there. So there is an incoming Steelers jersey coming soon. I don't know when, but there's a vintage Steelers jersey I ordered that I hope gets here ASAP. And I don't think any of you will guess, but this is not a steel jersey. Though. This is it, it. I know it sounds a little catchy, man, because I say it's an NFL jersey, but it's not a jersey of any of the 32 NFL franchises. But I can't wait to see what's in here, man. I can't. But I definitely cannot wait to see what's in this bad boy, man. God damn, y'all are running off now. Come on, I'm hope I was hoping you oh damn, now everyone's leaving. Damn. Everybody's leaving now. I mean I still got about 30 minutes before I still got 30 minutes left of this live stream. So, man, y'all want to see what's in this bad boy or what, man? Because I'm excited to show this. I'm honestly excited to show this jersey what's in here. What's up, Six Inc.? What's going on, Six Inc.? No, we were had. Man, I wish I could have been in that. I wish I could have been in that 44 live stream earlier, man, that longer. Noah's live stream. It was an interesting one to say the least. I wish it could have been in there longer, but I was at work and obviously my lunch break was over, so I had to dip when I did. But that was an interesting one. I don't know, did I miss anything or what? Did I miss anything interesting after that? After I had left that Noah live stream, but um but here's the deal, Six Inc. <laughs> There's an NFL jersey in here. It's an NFL jersey that's in here, right? However, it's not a Steeler jersey. Nor it's not a jersey of any of the 32 NFL franchises. It may sound confusing. It's an NFL jersey, but it's not a jersey of any of the 32 NFL franchises. I know it doesn't make sense, but if y'all know, if you dig deep into the history, then you'll get it. Then you'll get it if you dig deep into the history of it. But um, basically, it's a it's an NFL jersey, but it is not a Steelers jersey, nor any of the other 31 franchises. I mean. Shit, man, I wouldn't collect a jersey of any of the other 31 teams anyway, so it ain't a Steelers jersey, but it's not a jersey of any other NFL franchise. It, I know it sounds confusing, but y'all get it. What If you dig deep into the history and y'all see it, what's in here, you'll get it. But all I gotta say is it's vintage, really vintage, and I'm excited to show it to you guys. I really am. I really am excited to show this off and know this. But just put it out there. I don't want y'all to think, oh my God, he's he's repping another team. No, no, no. Mm -mm. It's not. It's not a jersey of any other NFL team, nor the Steelers. Okay? But it's an NFL jersey. Shit, man. Somebody was... Telling me to let him know when I when I go live. Why did I get that notification? Nope, not Cardinal. Nah, that'd be 
that would be repping another team because there are now the Arizona Cardinals. Because I, I clearly said it is not a jersey of any of the 32 NFL franchises. So obviously it ain't going to be a Chicago Chicago Cardinals jersey because that franchise still exists. That's the Arizona Cardinals. So no way it can be that, man. Mm-mm. And that would be ripping. That would be ripping another team if I did that. Hold on. Somebody was telling me to let him know when to go live, man. Somebody was letting me know to let him know when I'm live to reveal this because somebody wanted to see it. There is one person that knows what's exactly what's in there, but um Okay, there we go. But man, I want to reveal this man, but like I said, I only got 28 minutes left. You know, Raider Ben's going to go live in about less than 30 minutes, man, and y'all know I'm I got to end this as soon as as soon as the clock hits 11, man, I got to end this. So I don't got much time left. Who's in here right now, man? Because I got to reveal this motherfucker. I'm really excited to reveal this, man. I really am. I really am. I mean, shit. Come on off. <sighs> Oops. Oh, and I just got a note. I just got the notification right here. Raider Ben live in 30 minutes. So come on. So I was hoping I get a few more in here before Raider Ben goes live. He goes live in 30 minutes. You know, I got to get this jersey. What I miss, well, well, dashy. There's a jersey in here, right? It's an NFL jersey that's in here, but it is not a Steeler jersey, nor is it a jersey of any of the 32 NFL franchises. This is going to sound confusing to a lot of you, but it's an NFL jersey, but it's not. But it's not a jersey of any of the 32 NFL franchises. Some of you that know the history of, of, of the NFL and all that may know exactly what I'm talking about. But you really have to dig deep into the history, man, to know what's in this box once I pull it out. What's up, Bills Mafia? Doug? Welcome to the stream here. Like I said, this... This ain't gonna be long, guys, because once I, because I gotta end this by eleven, because Raider Ben's going live. So I gotta end this by eleven, because once I see that Raider Ben's live, this stream's over. This stream ends. But um, let's see. I hope so. Six Sync, Doug builds Mafia, Scott Zilla. Um, I don't have much time left here, so I'm gonna go ahead and. Start unveiling this bad boy, which is the same site where I got that beauty back there. Ooh. Definitely excited for this. You're waiting on your dinner. Do me a favor, y'all. Once I end this live stream, man. Head over to Raider Ben's once I end this. Okay. What the? There it is. Oh, shit. I can't do it like that. Um. Um. Yeah, I'm down to bet, man, but we'll talk about that when that when that day gets closer. 
when that day gets closer, we'll discuss it. But I'm down to bet. Yeah, definitely, man. And yes, I am. Shit, man. I'm I'm trying to figure out which game I'm going to this year, man. Because I'm because I do plan on going to a game this year, but I just gotta fix some few things and all that before I before I can decide which game I'm going to. So um Wait, 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 I just want to see it ain't up. Oh, shit. Okay, they didn't, they didn't fuck up, thank God. But, um, I'm excited. Ow. Well, I want to go to that one for obvious reasons. <laughs> but I'm either going to that game... Or the week two against the Raiders, the home opener. I'm either going to. I mean, I'm going to either one of those games, either week two against the Raiders or week six against against the Seahawks, because man, I gotta go back to Pittsburgh, man. So any of y'all, any of you Steeler fans that want to meet up in Pittsburgh, I'm just letting you know, yet letting y'all know right now. I'm either going to be a week two against the Raiders or week six against the Seahawks, okay? Just putting that out there right now. So so if any of you want to meet up over there in Pittsburgh, like Doug down here, anybody, I'm letting you know right now which games I'm going to probably go to this year, which game I'll probably end up going to. Yes, I saw his video. He's he's beefing with Raider Ben. Him and Raider Ben are beefing. I don't know exactly the whole story behind it, even though um Raider Ben explained it in his malt liquor video. Actually, man, I, I'm actually a big fan of those videos, man. Those malt liquor videos that he be doing, man. I fuck with those heavy. I wish I had some malt liquor on me right now. And if y'all want to see me drink alcohol tonight, man, Raider Ben's hang out. I'll be drinking at Raider Ben's, but on this stream, no. Yes, fortunately and unfortunately, I do pay up all my bets each time I lose. Um, I hate it, but I'm a man of my word at the end of the day, man. That's how I got raised. But um, I already op I cut open the box. Let's see, this is just in case they fucked up on this, which they didn't, unless it ain't my size. Wait, I want to make sure it's not. Well, definitely, it's a beauty just looking at the thing right now. Okay, it is my size. Thank God, it's my size. Nine people in the house. Hey, man, I'm. I was. You gotta have confidence in your team and all that, man. But but you also gotta be realistic too. You know, you also gotta be realistic. When I did my season prediction. When I did my early prediction for the Steelers, I did have us losing against the Bills. I did have us starting 0-1. Uh, hope I'm wrong when it comes to that, man. You know, Buffalo's got a good team, man. Uh, Nosferatu, I'm going to have to call you out on some shit right now. Well, you be seeing some, you be saying some weird ass shit, man. I left the reason why I left that that hangout we were all in because of the weird shit you were saying. I was like, "Yep, I'm out. I don't want to fucking hear it." And not only that, you know, me, Beast of the East, and I'm sure f several other people keep telling you. That there are certain panels you should not join. Okay? I told you several times that there's certain panels on here you should not be 
joining it's obvious like you i'm not gonna say but you you obviously have to have a disability and all that which you know i ain't gonna use that against you but there are certain panels you should not be joining because especially when you got guys like frank the gambler raider ben or billy badass in there if you see the any guys like that on the panel stay in the live chat i told you that several times me and a few other people but you did not want to listen you you basically went like oh fuck you erica still fuck your advice you don't you don't know what you're talking about and look what happened since you don't want to listen to what me and a few others say you got guys like greater ben making you cry you cried like three times on camera because you didn't want to listen to what I say. I told you not to join certain panels, but you go ahead and do it. You basically just did this to me. You basically, this is what you did. When you look at me, this is what you're doing. Basically say, oh, fuck what Eric has to say. Fuck him. Yeah. And then after that, you tried joining in the JP panel after the fact that you cried a few times. And you got Raider Ben made, made you cry already. But you still wanted to join a fucking panel. You still try to join a fucking panel. And then when I when me and Beast of the East told you, Joran, stay in the live chat. This ain't for you. Don't join. Your response was, oh, I can join whatever the fucking panel I want, Eric. I can join any panel i fucking want okay so from here on out from here on out if you join panels and somebody makes you cry my only my only response to that shit is not my problem since you want to give me that fucking attitude okay well you better bring that same attitude to me if if you're in a panel with me you better bring that attitude to me okay and I don't give a shit what I don't give a shit about this whole beef you have with beef you have with Nostar or any of that. I'm honestly annoyed by it. I don't give a fuck. You know, since you want to come up with that fucking attitude, and be like, oh, I can join any fucking panel I want. When we tried, we're doing that because we want to stick up for you. Hey, don't join certain panels, but you don't want to listen. And and look what happened for. You not want to listen to to me or, or any other people? Look at look what happened. Raider Ben made you cry, and somebody else made you cry as well. But I've seen like three occasions that 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 motherfuckers made you cry because you don't listen. Then after that, we told you, hey, this ain't for you. Don't join the panels. S stay out of it. But you were like, oh, I can join whatever fucking panel I want. That's your exact response to me. So. So, yeah, whatever happens from here on out, I don't care. If Raider Ben makes you cry again, not my problem. I don't give a shit. I don't care. Okay? So, you better come with the same fucking energy. If you're in a panel with me and shit like that, you better get come. You better be come up with that same attitude. Fuck out of here, man. You're like, you're honestly annoying me. Another thing, man. Stop blowing up my Instagram DMs. I'm literally one DM away from blocking you because you are honestly annoying to leaving shit out of me with shit that I don't give a fuck about. No, starting on that. I don't care. I don't care. You don't want to listen to what I say. You don't want to listen to what any of us that actually want to have your back and shit. Cool. Not my problem. If if Raider Ben makes you cry again, not my problem. Deal with it. I don't care. I won't feel bad or nothing. <sighs> he does it. This ain't for him. Six ink, bro. This ain't for him, man. Like he he obviously does not have thick skin. I mean, we tried telling him, but he don't want to listen. That's his problem. You no, know, he wants to let him do what he wants. I don't care. You know, since especially since he wanted to 
give the attitude that it gave to me when I try to help them. I don't I don't care from this from this point on. I don't give a fuck. No wants to come with that fucking attitude. Well, okay, your problem. You know, if Raider Ben if Raider Ben makes you cry again, then don't come venting over here about it. Cause I don't care. Anyways, oh shit, I only got 15 minutes left. But anyways. Here it is, ladies and gentlemen. Now, this is not a Steeler jersey, nor a jersey of any of the 32 NFL franchises, but, ladies and gentlemen, I present to you this right here. Now, some of y'all, some of y'all are asking, what is this? What is this? Exactly. Well, it is a Canton Bulldogs jersey. This is a Canton Bulldogs jersey. And what is the Canton Bulldogs? Who are the Canton Bulldogs? The Canton Bulldogs were an NFL franchise that was founded in 1903. They played in the league. They played in the Ohio League. They played in the Ohio League, and then they joined the NFL around 1919, around there. They joined the NFL, and um, they joined the NFL in 1919. They won a couple of NFL championships in 1922 and 23, I believe. But with, I don't know exactly what happened towards the end there, but the team, the franchise, ceased operations. Mac Main 70, what's up, man? They seized operations. Which by the way, shit, before I end this live stream, Mac Main, I'm gonna drop the link and I want you to come in here for, for a few, man. Wanna see how you're doing, bro. But anyways, um basically with this franchise, um they seized operations in 1927. They seized operations in 1927, which is, which is six years, six years before the Steelers even existed. Before the six years before the Steelers were founded, this franchise seized operations. But because of the, because of the early success, because of the early success that this franchise right here had, is pretty much the main reason why the pro. Football Hall of Fame is in Canton. So, yeah, this is a Canton Bulldogs jersey, an NFL franchise that existed from 1903 through 1927. And, yeah, it's vintage because of the success that this team had is the reason why the Hall of Fame is in Canton. And they... And this franchise owns a record of 25 consecutive games without a defeat, which is in still an NFL record today. So, yeah. So, yeah. Very. This is this is a very successful, successful franchise during its short history. But yeah, but. But if y'all want to know why the why the Hall of Fame is in Canton, this is the reason why it's right here. Let's put this bad boy on, shall we? No, this ain't no two team in or nothing. This is a this franchise seized operations before the Steelers even existed. This is some vintage shit. Every football fan would like this. So um let's put this bad boy on. I'm going to drop the link so that Mac Main 70 can come in here for a little bit before I end this and go to Raider Benz. So um, let's try this bad boy on, shall we? Yeah, man, definitely well worth the money to get this, man, but look at this. <laughs> look at this. As you can see right here, 
Here it is. 1923 Canton Bulldogs. The Canton Bulldogs. So, um, yeah, so any anyone that knows the history of the NFL or any football fan definitely would like this jersey. And it's I think any any football fan, it doesn't matter what team you root for or anything, should get this jersey. I'd recommend this jersey. Don't matter what team you root for, whether you're a Steelers fan, a Bills fan, a Saints fan, or anything. Um, this is some vintage shit, man. This is some vintage shit. Um proud to wear it and if anyone wants to say how this is two teaming then they're obviously a fucking retard so um let's see i got eight minutes left so um before before i gotta end this mac main 70 click the link sir mac main 70 click the link man i want to see how you're doing i want to say you're doing all that real quick before i before i wrap it up here because we got to go to raider bench and i I encourage the rest of you watching that as soon as I end this to go to Raider Benz. In fact, let me put the link to Raider Benz. Raider Benz Hain out. Let me put the link to Raider Benz so that you guys can just click on it automatically when, when I wrap it up here. Let me just... So yeah, Magman, come in here for briefly before I end this. I want to say how you're doing, man. I want to see how things are going down there. Let's see. I'm uh I'm gonna pin it. All right. All right. So there's the link to the Raider Ben Hay now. For y'all to click on when I end this in now seven minutes. Up oh, there he is. Mac what's up, man, man, what's up? Man? How you doing? I'm good. How about yourself? I'm there chilling, excited to reveal this man. Yeah, I like it. That's that's fire. I like that. Well worth the money. I like it's it. I got it from the same site where I got this. See, I made some changes so y'all can see that in the background whenever I'm live. Okay, okay. You know, I gotta I wrap like that it. beauty back there. Yes, sir. Yes, yeah, so how, how you doing, man? How, how are things the, down there? Things a lot better, man. It's kind of drying up now. Finally got a little sunlight uh, beginning this afternoon. It's been raining all week. Um, so it's it's still the water still up in some places, but overall, it's not as bad as they predicted. So it's still not out of the woods for some people yet, but it's it's not as bad as it could have been. Uh, like the flood of twenty sixteen is not nowhere near that. So, and glad we, to see you're doing well, man. And did you lose power by any chance or no? No, I didn't. I never lost any power. Uh, it blinked for a second, but it it never went out completely so so and that's crazy um, man and mm -hmm. i don't know if you saw this mac but um i revealed this the other night this other beauty <clears throat> oh iron mike iron mike yep. webster yes sir yeah i had to get uh, it man oh yeah oh yeah he's he is, he is, he's like probably the best center we ever had. Oh, no doubt about it, man. I mean, I didn't get to see him play or anything, but mm -hmm. no question, man. But it sucks how he died, though. Yeah, it did. It, it, it was sad. It was sad that he, you know, he died the way he did. But uh, apparently from listening to the Rooney's talk, they reached out to him, but he was kind of like refused all the help that they offered and stuff like that so i was kind of thinking that we just kind of let him drift out there like that when actuality they didn't they tried but he just was beyond the point of no return by then so yeah i heard terry bradshaw i guess off pay like his rant or whatever and right. but he all of a sudden disappeared without explanation and lived out of his pickup truck exactly yeah a whole lot of whole lot of people were trying to help him out but he was just he wasn't 
and he won't be helped. Yeah, Could and he been, was uh, he was not right up here at that, that time, yeah. man. He had the CTE, so obviously he wasn't processing things right. So yeah, just patient him. zero, pretty much. Yep, man. he kind of brought the was the first one that brought awareness to this concussion thing. So and where were let me uh when you first found out that news when he passed, where were you at the time? I don't know if you do you remember. Uh I really don't remember per se. Uh I don't think I found out uh until like the day after. Uh but probably just at home. I just but I don't I don't I don't really remember per se. I wasn't even a football fan yet. I was too young anyways. I was only about seven, eight years old at the time. Right. I didn't start right. watching it till two years after he passed. Okay, okay. Yeah. Yeah, I, I'm, uh, yeah, I don't I don't like I said, I wasn't I don't really remember exactly where I was. You know, you know. Ain't no telling what I, I was probably running wild back then too. So, I, I, was I, was. <laughs> I, was I was just a kid. I was just a kid. I was doing. That's it. All I did back in those days was watch NASCAR and soccer. That's all I was watching back in those days. Right. Because I had to get into the football part on my own. My parents, they don't give a shit about football. They don't. Yep. Yeah, but but things wasn't like they are now with, with the social media and news didn't travel as fast as it travels now, you know back then when he passed away so uh so it's kind of yeah it, so it it being in a being an out of market fan i probably didn't get it right away anyway because you know i'm i'm in saints country so shit i was i'm patriots country man <clears throat> i know how that mm -hmm. is being the outsider but i chose to be a a I chose to be that guy that's different, that reps the other another team instead of what everybody roots for, you know. I chose that life and I don't regret it. Yeah, me too. Me too. Yes, sir. I don't regret it one bit. I know people ask me, oh well, you could have been seeing your team win six Super Bowls and all that instead of just mm -hmm. two, but I was like, nah, I'm good. Exactly. Exactly. I'm good. I, I ain't no bandwagon. Mm -hmm. But this jersey is a bit warm, though, but I like the feel of it. And up yeah. here kind of feels like an ugly sweater when you wear it up right. here. Mm -hmm. So this is, you can tell it's vintage. Yeah, I like it. I like it. It's different. Yeah. I, I like it, but it's still it's still cool looking sweater uh, or a jersey. It looked more like a sweater than a jersey. <laughs> and it feels like a sweater too. It definitely feels a lot different than that one. I got it from the same website as that one right there. Okay, okay. Yeah, I like it. So, yes, sir. All right, man. So I'm yeah. to con have you on here real quick. Raider Ben's live, so we are gonna go over there. So, and I encourage everybody watching to go over there. Raider Ben saying out, Mac, thanks for stopping by. I hope to see you over there too, man. Yeah. Well, actually, I'm going to Uptown's hangout, so that's where I'll be at. So, hey, do do it what where you want to go, you know? <laughs> yes, sir. But hopefully you enjoy it. And you know, I'm sure it, I'm sure to be entertaining. Ben runs a great stream too. So, but that's where we'll be at. So I'll probably be popping in in the comments, checking y'all out. All right, thanks for having. Hey, go Steers. Hope, hope you don't see me as a two teamer by seeing this. This is I, just I vintage don't. shit. I don't. I, this is just vintage. It's still black and gold for life. Yeah, I didn't. I didn't. I never picked that up. You good? You good with me? You always gonna be solid with me though. We straight. So. Yeah, even even back. Then, <laughs> uh, <laughs> it is good that we can laugh about it now with the, all the drama from four years ago. Oh yeah. Yeah, <laughs> <laughs> with the Popeye shit. And all. That shit crazy, man. That shit crazy, but hey, to laugh about it now, man. But yep. at the time, I was like, "What the fuck was I thinking when I said it?" You know, and I don't got an issue with parks, man. I fuck with parks. Yeah, I park, a lot. 
I yeah, fuck with I Deshaun talk, Parker. That's my dude. There, I talked to that dude earlier today. So, yeah, man. Yeah, I'm, so, mm-hmm. so we'll be on there talking shit like we always do. So, but uh, appreciate you having me on. Uh, you know, I'm sure you'll probably do something before the weekend out, and I get a chance to pop in again. Yeah, tomorrow night I am going live to hope. Okay, the person's not in here in the comments, but basically I'm doing a, I'm doing a birthday stream for one of my most loyal subscribers. Okay. Um, last, you know, last Jedi, right? Yeah, I've I've heard yeah. of, I've seen a, I've seen her in your in your streams. Yeah, she's a Saints fan, but um, mm-hmm. her it's a birthday tomorrow, and I figured I'd do a live stream for her birthday tomorrow night. You know, okay. and it's gonna be a hangout. So I'm, okay. in a way, I'm kind of glad Ben's doing his hangout tonight instead of tomorrow mm-hmm. because of right. it. Right. Well, I got to go dog sit for my boss to, tomorrow. He's going out of town, so I'm dog sitting his great day uh, tomorrow all the way to Thursday. So, so I'll be I'll be dog sitting for the next week. You know, so that's hey, what sounds I'll be fun. Doing. My sister used to do that. Oh yeah. So that's what I'll be doing. So, but I'll be around, man. Uh, so I ain't gonna hold you. I'll let you go and catch up with Ben, and I'll catch up with you next time. All right. Um, All right. Y'all know where to go. Uptowns or Ben's Hannah. I'm gonna be in Ben. So hope to see y'all there. Y'all have a good one, Mac. All thanks right. for stopping by, man. Thanks for checking on me, brother. Take care. You too. All righty.